Now I am going to dictate a journal passage based on Speed Writer magazine at the rate of 80 words per minute. Let's start. Sir, I have tried to touch upon some of the important aspects of the bill. The setting up of the family courts is not something very new in the world. There are a number of advanced countries namely Britain, Japan and Australia that have already set up family courts to settle family disputes in a totally different environment where the concerned parties sit together with the judge who acts as a counselor and makes a sincere effort to bring about conciliation this procedure will also help avoiding long and arduous court procedures and will be available to the aggrieved parties at almost no cost para sir one more advantage which will accrue as a result of setting up of family courts will be the considerable reduction in the workload of the civil courts sir i very sincerely urge the house to consider the kindness of the people and also that of the government for simplifying the legal procedure to afford justice to the larger number of people in lesser time and money i am fully confident that the bill will receive the whole hearted and unanimous support of the house para change now sir i read the speech regarding the other bill regarding the dowry prohibition act i would like to mention at this stage that i will confine myself to a few preliminary observations to give an idea as to the approach adopted by the government in dealing through legislation with the problem of a dowry menas para the evil of dowry system has been a matter of serious concern to everyone in view of its ever increasing and disturbing proportion how this menace is to be checked curbed and eradicated is something which has to be viewed on a totally non partition and non political basis para as the joint committee of the house on the working of the dowry prohibition act 1961 has rightly pointed out the existence of the dowry system is social problem and the remedy therefore can be found by creating social awareness in the society the evil cannot be eradicated unless social consciousness revolts against it every time and on every occasion so far as a legislative solution for dealing with the evil is concerned as pandit jawaharlal nehru observed legislation cannot by itself normally solve deep rooted social problems said one has to approach them 
in other ways too but legislation is necessary and essential in such cases stop thank you